Wow, third phase moon breaking news just in. We're gonna be speaking with Mrs. Stevens sharing this footage all the way from Southern California. We're looking at multiple photographs, video angles of the same event happening in real time. Wow, we, uh, we reached out to Mrs. Stevens. She returned our call and we got her right here at Third Phase Moon. Uh, welcome. Hi. All right, you sound a... Hello? Yep. Hey, hey, thanks a lot. Thanks for joining us. Tell us, how did this go down? Um, did you capture this today and who was with you at the time? No. Go ahead, yep. yep. I know it's quite a, it's an amazing capture that you captured. We're looking at it. It looks like a flying saucer. Yeah, so my niece noticed this. Really? Object in the sky. And we started, um, we started to video it and uh, videotape it. I've never seen anything like that. It was just, I don't, <laughs> it was amazing. <laughs> wow, the, you know, the video lasts for about 30 or so seconds. Uh, how, were there other people in the same area that noticed this thing? Or was oh, it, yeah. Really? Oh, yes. Yes. So there's multiple videos that uh, you think other people may have captured? I'm sure this? there must be, yeah. There okay. must be other videos. Wow, we're looking at the video right now, and it just shoots off. Like, yeah, oh. just tell us just about that. In a second, it was gone, like a blink. That's what we're seeing right now. It is uh, quite incredible. We uh, we're analyzing the video, Miss Stevens. Oh, and, really? Oh. Yeah, and with your uh, niece's video that you sent us, along with these photographs, it's kind of a uh, overwhelming going over it right now. But this, the way it blinks out, just like hyperspace, a supersonic jump. Let me ask you, did this thing make any noise whatsoever from the beginning and the end? No, I didn't hear anything, any sounds. It was quiet. So after the event was done, were you looking around? What were other people doing? What was the scene? They were looking at their videos that they just took. <laughs> wow. <laughs> yeah. So <laughs> and looking at the sky, trying to see if it would come back, but... No, it's, it's gone. It was gone. It left. Miss Stevens, uh, how did you? Uh, let me ask you this: Did are, do you believe in ET UFOs? Did you have any experiences like this before? What was your thought? Government, extraterrestrial? I don't know. I just felt like um, I just thought they were extraterrestrial visitors. You know, checking us out or something. Really? What about uh, your niece? She kept saying, it's a UFO, look, look, okay. Auntie, there's a UFO. She was just, <laughs> yeah, she was just all excited. Yeah, tell us about this. There's there's really loud music back in the background, and we had to delete or mute the audio. Kind of, there's some swearing going on, so we decided to mute it. So, but yeah, we could hear it, that you're... Oh. We got Brent Cousins here. He wants to ask a question to you. Go ahead, Brent. Yes, Miss Stevens, thanks for joining us. This UFO, it's, it's amazing, it's outstanding, it's very large. It must have felt overwhelming when it was coming over you guys. What was, I'm just oh, trying okay. to get the essence of your feeling when this came over you. Oh my God, it was, it was awesome. It was like, <laughs> my heart's still beating, just thinking about it just beating so fast. It was, uh, I keep looking at the sky a lot now. Well, I bet you... Hopefully uh, I see it again, <laughs> but... So you felt like there was a friendly encounter. You didn't feel yeah. like you... Yeah, that's what it felt like. It was just, it was exciting to see it, you know? It was just, I can't describe it. <laughs> what would you say to anybody that's going to say that this is a, a fake or a CGI contemplation Photoshop for that matter? there so they shouldn't say nothing bad you know I mean I was there I saw it I videotaped it so did a bunch of other people you know my niece 
Miss Stevens, I gotta say, it is incredible evidence that you and your niece shared with us right here at Third Phase Moon. How did you come across this anyway? Oh, oh, I've, uh, I've checked your site out before. I've, I've heard about you through friends. So, um, yeah, I, that's how I found out about you. Well, um, you know, appreciate your friends and everybody uh, shouting out. I think it's the fastest way to get information just like what you're witnessing to the world as fast as light speed. Hey, thanks for joining us right here at Third Phase Moon. Have your cameras close and uh, keep us updated. We'll be uh, keeping in touch. Brent, you got one more thing? Go ahead. Yeah, I just want to get this in before the interview is over because this is such fascinating evidence. Miss Stevens, we notice and we're zooming in on this large craft definitely disc-like and it has this rotating light you see happen every like two to three seconds. Did you see that too as well, the red light? Yes, I did. Quite amazing. We're going to share this with our friends on Facebook and have new updates of more enhanced footage. I know uh, we're, we're showing a few clips and videos. They don't move that fast. <laughs> in a blink of an eye, it's gone. Yeah, that's right. Everybody, keep your eyes on the sky. It's quite amazing. We're going to share this with our friends on Facebook and have new updates of more enhanced footage. I know uh, we're, we're showing a few clips and videos. We're going to go over uh, what we just heard in real time. We just got off the phone. It's been about an hour since we've seen this video. We're going over it. We're looking at it closely. We're going to share our personal opinions of what it is. And right away, I believe her story. I, I believe she seems very genuine. Her uh, niece, we got two videos, multiple photographs. Now it's time to see if other videos come in from the area. Now that would be confirming the smoking gun event that happened just today. Brent, what's your thoughts? Two sources coming in is a good start. It's it's happening right now southern coast of california is a hot spot and it's been go been hot for the past three four years right here at third phase moon it's been lighting up we've discovered offshore possible bases could this be one of its transporting devices its vehicle that's a uso something going underwater right off the coast of southern california Let's get down to the, the video itself. Is it legit? Is it the real deal? When we're looking at it up close, you can see refractions of light. There's that red light that you can see kind of popping off the right hand or left hand shoulder, depending on where you're looking at it. There's an anomaly going on there. And then also as it takes off, that would be quite hard to do in a CGI program. In my opinion, I think what you're looking at is the real deal. And again, testimony on top of video. It doesn't get much better than that. I feel and believe this footage is legitimate. The testimony, as you said, Blake, is well documented. I believe in Miss Stevens. I believe in what we're seeing right here. And I suggest everybody else do their own research. There's possible alien technology right in front of our face, and I'm happy about that. What I'm happy about, Brent, is that people share their videos right here at Third Phase, and we're able to get it out to the world real fast. And I'm looking forward to seeing what happens tomorrow. I hope the world wakes up, realizes we're not alone. Everybody keep your eyes on the skies. This is breaking news right here at Third Phase of Moon. We'll see everybody again next time. By popular demand, we are pleased to announce the third Phase of Moon album is finally featured on iTunes. With all your favorite songs and themes, you hear on the top UFO channel on YouTube, Third Phase of Moon. Out of this world soundtracks composed by master artist Paul Barrett. With 12 remastered and extended cuts to enjoy. Download them now, exclusive on iTunes. Click the link in the description below. Now listen for yourself, heard by millions around the world, Paul Barrett's album.
third phase of moon.